Okay, hello everyone. Okay, now I will show how to encrypt or decrypt connection string in ASP.NET. Okay, now we just go to do with me. Okay, just, I will go to create a new project for ASP.NET. We will go to VB, yeah, Visual Studio. I use Visual Studio 2015. Okay, now just open it. Okay, now I create new project. <coughs> okay, I will try. Okay, uh, ASP project. Okay, and I will store on my this part. Okay, ready and folder ASP.NET. You can just go to cloud for use this one. This. Okay, now I choose. Uh, resource the six uh, window and web and asp.net web application and tie your new project and okay it will yeah so must be select your project form okay now i choose empties and we just click select this template and click okay okay i click cancel yeah, create team projects, ASP projects. Okay, yeah, create already. We just go to this folder. Right click on your solution projects and open folder in File Explorer for find your projects. Yeah, this is my project on this. And okay, we just go to config connection string in web. Yeah, web.config this one web.config just go to find it on ASP projects and just you can see like this <coughs> okay this one okay now I will create a connection string okay I don't want to tie just copy it this is my connection string this one for example yeah put on under system number uh, f okay this one connection string uh, name yeah your connection name and uh, connection strings uh hi your server name database name uh, the username yeah user id username and password for login your database okay and this is default for it <coughs> okay now just go to uh, encrypt this connection this lock okay now just go to open yeah command from in visual studio 2015 on visual studio 2015 you can go to yeah open for developer command from for studio visual studio okay if you use other version uh, uh, previous version you can go to find uh, Visual Studio command from yeah on this version on Visual Studio 2015 you can go to find developer command from for VI to 2015 okay if you use the user you can right click and run uh, as administrator but now I go I use on administrator account you can just click on it only okay now just click on it okay this one and you can tie your uh, command okay asp net underscore yeah read as and then ties p e f yeah Part in grid folder and you can tie the yeah, post connection string, yeah, and your part. Okay, your part you can go to find your part on this. You can go to find your part, this one, open folder in File Explorer, and copy this 
yeah, copy this, this part, oh sorry, copy this part, <coughs> copy this part, and go to pass, yes, this one, go to pass it, and come on, yeah, code, and you can press enter, your this was um, administrator install and administrator uh, our machine could be increase config section 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 string is not found oh sorry at high wrong on this yes okay you can try this as sp that underscore PDF connection string and you your part again and press enter. Yeah, this yeah encrypt is successful for your integration. Okay. Go to your project, it will alert for you. That is for sale this far on. Yes. Okay, I click. Uh, yes. Yes. This lock is encrypted already. Okay. Yes. Okay. When you encrypt already, but you want to decrypt, you can go to Thai command from again. Okay. Now I Thai uh, the same part, but you can go to change 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 letter is to be yeah part descript folder for descript web dot config yeah folder okay now you can highlight this already this is a command for you can tie this but you can change this if your project uh, you put somewhere okay okay now just Type already, change already, you can press enter. It will show you like this. So this. Okay. This. This uh, encrypt pin configuration section successfully. When you go to click on your project, it will select for you. It yes for go to default connection. Previous reset, you can click on it, install in like this. Okay, you understand? You can tie out this command for for encrypt. Yeah, for encrypt. And this command for decrypt connection. Okay, already. Okay, thank you for watching this video. I hope I can help you some. Bye bye.